All right, guys, so today we're going to talk about how do you store your bottles so you can reuse them for, for bottling in the future. So here I have just a commercial beer uh, you know, that, we've, that we drank, and the key to reusing commercial bottles was first off, you want to make sure that the lip is just one continuous uh, lip. You know, it's not twisty, it doesn't have a twist on cap, so like any of those crappy domestic beers like your Budweiser's that have a twist off cap, you, you really don't want to use because it's hard to get a perfect seal, especially with a home capper. Uh, so you want to use a, you know, most craft brewers use bottles like this that have a single continuous lip and there's no twist. You have to pop them off with a bottle opener. And so immediately after you're done with the beer, uh, the, the key to making this your life so much easier is you just fill it up, you know, maybe a quarter of the way, and just do this to rinse out all the sugars. Do this. I recommend doing it three times, especially if it's a really malty beer, like a Doppelbach or Imperial Stout. And then you just shake it out and just set it out kind of to air dry. You might check it a few hours later and there will be some more water collected and dump it out and that's it and store it in a box with the lid on it and you should be good to go. Then on bottling day, all you need to do is hook up your bottle washer, you know, it'll shoot out any of the dust that's collected in there under high pressure and then you sanitize it using a sanitizer like this that shoots the sanitizing solution into the bottle uh, and you're good to go. You can you reuse, reuse this, you don't have to take the labels off, you can if you want, but it's kind of a pain in the ass. So that's it.